Chicos, Harry here from Chat Spanish, teaching you useful things the locals actually say in Latin America and Spain. I'm glad the clickbaity thumbnail worked here. I didn't actually shag a bus, but that's what my Chilean friends thought when I was trying to say that I was going to catch the bus. I accidentally said I'm going to have sex with the bus. That's coger versus tomar. I'm going to show you a very important thing you need to know here and what the difference is. So tomar, infinitive AR verb. It, they both mean to take or to catch or to grab, but tomar is used in Latin America. So if you're in Latin America or speaking to someone from Latin America, always go with tomar because coger means to have sex with in a more crude, crude way actually than that. So tomar is to take or to grab and you're going to use that in Latin America. Never use coger unless you want to be a bit vulgar and you're with some really close mates. An ejemplo, voy a tomar el autobús. I'm going to catch the bus. So tomar here is used to catch or to take the bus. And actually in Chile, el autobús I found out is called un micro, the micro. El micro is the bus in Chilean Spanish. So voy a tomar el autobús. Do not use coger here as I did. I'm going to shag the bus. Voy a coger el autobús in Chile or in Latin America that will be seen as I'm going to have sex with the bus. So be very careful, chico. Ojo, that's another thing in Spanish they say. Ojo means I, they say ojo, look out, be careful. Don't use coger in Latin America. In Spain, you can use it as we'll see, but in Latin America, tomar. Toma esta bebida, take this drink. So again, another example of tomar, to take, just something, you know, um, a material object, toma esta bebida. Toma esta chaqueta, take this jacket, take this drink. And this is the imperative here, command. Now, coger. In Spain, this is super common. You'll hear this a lot. So again, reframe. Latin America, always use tomar. Spain, coger is pretty common, but they also use tomar as well, which I'll explain. But coger, you use that in Spain. Voy a coger el autobús. So same phrase as before. In Chile, this is translated, or in Latin America, translated, I'm going to have a sex with the bus. In Spain, don't worry, you can relax. It's going to, I'm going to catch the bus. I'm going to take the bus. So you use that with public transport. And another example, coge estos pantalones. Take these trousers, you know. So um, in Spain, coger, very, very common to take. And that's it for the video. All I would say is um, make sure you have fun with it. It doesn't matter if you use coger in Latin America when you should really be using tomar because it makes for some quite funny stories and the locals will find it funny and endearing actually. So they, they are kind of laughing at you but not in a mean way. So I've experienced myself. So don't be afraid to make mistakes is what it's all about. Have fun. Subscribe to the channel. You better subscribe please. Get that Give that thumbs up a little click and leave some comments if you have any questions, if you have any other funny stories. Gracias. Ciao.